Hello, this is Kenneth Wong, contributing editor for Desktop Engineering Magazine. You might not have heard of the name of the company Crebate, but perhaps you have heard of its products, PowerCAD and FelixCAD. Well, the new product from the company is called Eris, named after the Greek god of war, I believe. Naturally, it came out swinging as a stellar 2D drafting and drawing package, available in two editions, Eris Standard and Eris Commander. Let's take a closer look at the standard version. There is a command line option available, but the software also gives you the option to use a series of dialog boxes to let you customize and display your systems. Here, for example, is how you might set up your polar tracking and snapping behaviors on screen. I find its patterning dialog box with the preview window easy to understand and use. Here, for example, is how you might create a linear patterning to repeat something vertically and horizontally. If you need to fill an object with color and gradient or hatches, this is how you do it. And here's how you might mirror something. Along with the text insert option, as a note, you can also customize your text font, size, and adjust the text flowing area. Now what I really like is the way you can, after drawing something, select the entire thing and edit each point simply by pushing, pulling, nudging, or grabbing and moving them around. This makes your 2D drawing object behave more like a spline object. Now watch what happens to the dimension if I grab this point and reposition it elsewhere. See? The dimension value automatically readjusts itself to match the new length. By the way, there's also a spline tool so you can create complex curves and lines this way. If you'd like, you can insert a reference object for tracing. By the same token, you can also insert an external Excel table. All in all, this is a pretty stable, strong debut product and it's based on Open Design Alliance technology so it's DWG compatible. The standard version cost 495 and the Commander edition is 995 Till next time, this is Kenneth Wong and Ares, the God of War, for Desktop Engineering Magazine.